so as it's near the end of November I thought today would be the perfect day to do my November favourites with you all. So for those of you who don't know what my November favourites are, they're just basically items that are random that I've really enjoyed having or wearing or using during the month of November and I put them all together in a list at the end to share with you all so let's get started. Okay, so my favourite TV show of the month of November has been Z Nation. Now, for those of you who don't know what Z Nation is, it is basically a comedy zombie TV show from America. It is hilarious. It's about a man that got bit by a load of zombies, but he didn't turn, and now he carries, like, a, a cure for being you know, not being a zombie, and it is just hilarious. I absolutely love the character Murphy. He's like a blue smurf, which is brilliant. Smurfs are blue anyway, so I don't know why he'd be a blue smurf. <laughs> um, so yeah, it's just a brilliant, brilliant show. It's kind of like, I personally think it's a spin-off from The Walking Dead, a comedy version, but um, I love The Walking Dead as well, but this month has been dedicated to none other than Z Nation, so it's brilliant. If you guys haven't watched it, they are on season two already, but try and find season one to check it out, and then let me know in the comments below what you think. Okay, so my favourite drink of been these bad boys it's clippers raspberry leaf infusion now i'm not one usually for um fruit teas i do just like your normal good old proper brew but um don't know why but this month i have loved these raspberry tea ones now they smell amazing most raspberry tea that i have tried that i thought would be nice really wasn't it was just like drinking really warm water which was not nice um, but these are amazing so if any of you like fruit tea and like raspberry like myself I do recommend trying these because they're also organic which is great and they are refreshing so um, these have been my favourite kind of tea hot drink for this here um, month cold drink I've just been enjoying orange juice so um, yeah pretty boring Okay, so my favourite snack of the month are these here. Now, as you all know, it's getting closer to Christmas and the festive season, and these have started coming out in the shops more and more now, and I'm super excited. So they are chestnuts. Absolutely love chestnuts. I'm keeping them in the bag because if any of the bits fall out, Harvey's here, I don't want to hoover them up. So um, chestnuts are amazing. I've got these from Sainsbury's. So um, as you guys know, I've got a wood burner, or we have a wood burner now, not the same as an open fire, but what we tend to do is just place them along the top of the wood burner and they cook amazingly. So these have been like our midnight lately. Love them. So um, chestnuts are my all time favourites at the moment. Okay, so article of clothing. Now I couldn't just pick one favourite. I had to pick two. And because it's becoming colder and like this morning it was minus three, I think, first thing it was really cold and there's nothing more than waking up and wearing a pair of fluffy socks now these here are the christmas ones i haven't opened them yet they were from primark i love primark fluffy socks um and they're super cheap as well and they just last forever so um these are their christmas ones i haven't opened them because i'm not going to open them until december but um i couldn't find any of the others i think they're in the wash somewhere um so fluffy socks for when you come home if you just want to chill on the sofa you just pop them on and they keep your feet nice and cosy and my favorite second article is of course you guys know I like pashminas but because it's getting colder now I like something a bit thicker so when I went to Scotland you guys probably saw it in my Scotland vlogs I was wearing this a lot now this is my snood I think it's called which is like a giant scarf hood thing which you can do like that or you can wear it as a hood Whoops, I've got to call my clip. Like that. Absolutely love it. Okay, so for my favourite hair care product of this month, I have been absolutely addicted to Avon's Natural Hair Care Daily Hair Refresher in uh, <laughs> Hibiscus and Raspberry. Now, this here is just basically a hair refresher. I wash my hair every night, but sometimes it's just nice to be able to touch it up with a bit of this and it smells amazing. I just absolutely love it. So um, yeah, I don't know what else to say about it really. That's just been my favorite kind of hair care product this month. Okay, so for my favorite makeup this month, I have been loving mascaras. I've tried hundreds of different mascaras and I don't know why I'm absolutely addicted to them. 
but one stood out by a mile for me and that is Unique's 3D Moodstruck um, or oh, sorry Unique's Moodstruck 3D Fibre Lash there now this was actually a gift from a friend of mine she is a unique representative now what I'll do is I'll leave all of her details down below in the, the description bar so you can go and check out all their products I did receive an eyeshadow for her which I'm going to do a review on both this and the eyeshadow so keep your eye out for that but this here is honestly the best mascara ever two different products you get a gel and a like fibers gel on fibers on gel on and you can just keep repeating the process until you've got the desired length and fullness for your lash and I am absolutely obsessed with this at the moment. So if you guys want to go and purchase your own, I will leave her down below, or all of her details down below, where you can go and get the products from. And honestly, they do cost a little bit, don't get me wrong, they are quite expensive, but for what they do, and for how long they last, I couldn't recommend this highly enough. So go and buy one. I think they are nearly, or they might have already gone over their one millionth mascara sold, which is absolutely crazy. But, um... Go and check it out. And if you do purchase one from her, then do tell her that I sent you to her because then she'll be super grateful. So, um, yes, these are the best mascara ever. Okay, so for my favourite book at the moment, I don't usually get time to read books because I'm so busy. But I've managed to read through the Fifty Shades of Grey trilogy and haven't yet read Grey my mum's got it, I'm waiting to borrow it off her because she said she'll give it to me when she's finished, but she hasn't even started yet, so I might have to pinch that one after I finish my current novel. But the Fifty Shades of Grey and the Crossfire novels, now they are basically the same as Fifty Shades of Grey. Brilliant stories. And it's really got me kind of hooked on that kind of genre, I don't know why. So I heard a lot about this author on Facebook through friends and through other people on YouTube as well. And I thought I'd give it a go. And that is Meredith Wilde and it's the Hardwired. Now I can't, the Hacker series. I think there are six, five or six books. This is basically the same as Fifty Shades of Grey. Really, really good book. Um, I do recommend them. If you do like Fifty Shades of Grey and you have re um, read the Crossfire novels, then this would be your next series. As you can see, it says Sizzling, Sizzles Like Sylvia Day, who is the author of the Crossfire novels. Um... I'm not really one for reading books, but I've already got through that much of it within like a couple of days. And I didn't know if I was going to like it, so I only bought the one. And then I am hooked on it, so I had to go and buy the other four or five. I can't remember. Um, so yeah, honestly, if you want another good novel, I would highly recommend this for reading. It's a really good book, so go and purchase it and give it a go. Okay, so for my favourite song of the month, it has to be none other than Sam Smith with his amazing song, Writings on the Wall, from the new James Bond film. Absolutely obsessed with it. Everywhere I go, I can't stop listening to it. It's on the radio, it's on the TV, it's being used for backing music for a programme incredible song and now that the Christmas songs have started coming out as well and I haven't heard it for a long time and I really forgot all about it and I feel really bad but that is Leona Lewis's One Last Sleep and I love that song as well so again two really good songs for my favourites for November okay and last but not least is Harvey's favourites of the month now he has been absolutely addicted to these bad boys these are the Purina Adventurous, um, these are the Nuggets in Boar flavour, and these are the Sticks in Buffalo flavour. He does also like the Venison flavour, but he has been absolutely addicted to these. Um, you say to Har Harvey's one of these dogs now, that if you say, do you want a treat, he knows where they're kept, and he will go straight to his cupboard, and he'll sit waiting for one. If you give him, like, a Bonio or something like that at the moment, he turns his nose up at him. Get him in one of these and he takes it and it's gone within a second. So he absolutely loves these. These are the bigger um, sticks for the dogs. They do small ones as well for smaller dogs, which is great. The nuggets, just nugget size, so they're for any kind of dog. And also the venison strips are just like, um, what are they similar to? Uh... Those things from Pedigree, I can't remember what they're called, the long strips, can't remember, but the long strips strips from Pedigree, they're similar to those, but they're a bit thicker and they're more like meatier, they're full of more meat for the dog, so that's really good. So they're Harvey's favourite, so um, all round good. 
Okay guys, that's it for my monthly favourites. Thank you so, so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this video and would like to see some more, then please give it a huge thumbs up. And if you haven't already and want to continue watching some of my videos, then please don't forget to hit that red subscribe button down there, or up there, whichever one you prefer. And I will talk to you all really, really soon. Cheerio!